Hi everyone, it's Brian and welcome back to my channel. I'm going to do a bit of a strange video today because uh, I don't have a lot of time. I've been, we've been packing to go on a camping trip. Sorry, the camera, I usually don't use a phone either. I usually use a computer that's uh, sitting on a flat surface, so I'm shaking the phone a bit. Uh, we're uh, going on a camping trip, so I'm going to be off most of next week, but I wanted to put a video out, so I thought I would do the laziest video I could imagine, and that is... Um, to just uh, not prepare anything. So so this is a uh, contest entry for Robert. Robert's on my turntable. A fellow Canadian who lives just up the highway. Now I realize this is going to skew my ratio of contest to other videos, but be that as it may, I feel like I'm compelled to do a contest for a fellow Canadian. And um, it's very simple. His um, his request is that uh, to enter the contest, just do a, uh, a video that spells out the word thousand in uh, album or band titles, I guess. And if you can't do that, you can spell out the word grand. So rather than pull the records off in advance and sit down and do research and talk to you with them, I'm just going to go around to each uh, section of the alphabet. I'll go to the T section and I will uh, pull something, not necessarily random, I'll just pull something off. And then I'll go through the whole, uh, till we get to the end of the thousand, and that'll be my entry. So lazy, I'm picking a lazy route today, but I hope it works out. And I will see you after my camping trip. So I'm going to pause this because I have to flip the camera around to the other side. Hang on. Into the um, T section. Let me just see what's here. What looks good? Oh, well, uh, how about Them? The story of Them featuring Van Morrison for T. This is good. I'm a big Van Morrison fan. So what does this have on it? Can't remember. There you go. Not a bad. There's other. There's probably better them um, them collections, but this is pretty good. Should I put it back in now? Let's just leave it here. So thousand. That's T. I gotta go to H. Find the H. H. Where are we here? Um. Oh, okay. The first thing I saw was I talked about this band before. The Hold Steady. This is Boys and Girls in America. This is the. Deluxe reissue from 2016. So this has the original album. Uh, starts off with the fantastic Stuck Between Stations. Oh man, this is such a good record. Man, this is so good. And then it has, um, Side C has some uh, B-sides plus a demo. And Side D has uh, some demos, which is pretty good. So this is fantastic. One of my favorite bands. From the 2000s, TH. You can see how my records don't actually. Oh, there we go. TH. What's next? TH. O. Oh. Okay. O. Oh, let's find O. Let's see what's under O. Oh. There's a pack of records here I haven't put away. Did I block all my O's off? Oh, well, let's just pick up something from here. Um. Let's see. What do we have? Ah. Okay. Orchestral maneuvers in the dark. Sorry for the glare. Normally I take the the uh, plastic off. This is um, a best of collection from can't read 1988, which has all the big hits, electricity messages, and all the gay souvenir. Joan of Arc, Made of Orleans, talking loud and clear, which has a very strange video. Tesla girls, locomotion, so in love, secret. If you leave, forever live and die, and then dreaming, which was only ever released on this um, this version, this record. And later, and also later, uh, best of from OMD. T H O T H O U. Let's see if you can find some U. Let's see. What do we have here? Um. Oh, here's some. Oh, yeah. I'll just pull this out. Oh, yeah. Here we go. UB40 Labor Love. This was a hugely popular record uh, back in the day. So this has Red Red Wine, a song I got so sick of because I heard it so many times. Cherry O' Baby's on here. It's good. All cover versions. And I kind of lost interest in UB40 after this record, but I do have some other things from them. S. Let's see where we are here. There's a lot to choose from in, in S. Here's something uh, that I've actually only listened to once. This is a bootleg. This is um, Simple Minds, 
Ghost Dancing, um, which is a double or I think it's a double live. No, sorry, it's a triple live. There's three records in here. And the track listing is not on the back. And I've only listened <laughs> to it once. I can't remember what the sound was like. So that was Simple Minds. A. Find some A's. Um, let's see what looks good here. Um, wow, hard to choose. Uh, okay, first thing I pulled out was Alphaville. You know, I actually have a soft spot for the song Forever Young. I mean, it's sort of the, the lyrical content really speaks to me and it brings me back to a certain place. What other tracks were on here that were good? Well, Big in Japan was a pretty big track. Um, Sounds Like a Melody was a pretty big track. So this is a, I recall now when this was a thrift find for me, I paid like a buck or two for that record. A, let's go to N, if I can find some N's here, CDs over there. N, 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 N. that's going to be, oh, let's just see what's here, that looks good. Sorry, this thing has kind of blocked everything. These are some soundtracks and various things. Oh. Okay. Berserker. Gary Newman from... I don't remember the year on this. Berserker, This Is New Love, The Secret... My Dying Machine, which is a pretty cool track. Um, this was a hard record to find in Canada. I remember at the time, it was I could, there was a... 12 inch single for Berserker. Here it is. Sorry, um, yeah, for Berserker, but it was hard to find this record. It, I don't know if it was re released here or this is just an import. I think this is definitely an import. Have I done this right? T H O U S A N D. Uh, oh, there's so much Bob Dylan. Here's a strange one. This is. <laughs> here we go. Terrence Trent Darby. This guy's changed his name recently to something I can't remember and I don't understand the reason for it, but I think everybody knows uh, the song Wishing Well, which I think is pretty good. I honestly have a hard time remembering the rest of the songs on this record, but he has a great voice and I've always liked that song, Wishing Well. I think it's pretty good. And uh, just remember, go visit uh, Robert's on my turntable. It's a fellow Canadian and... Uh, He's trying to get a thousand subs, so go over there and uh, I'll talk to you after my camping trip. Talk to you later. Bye.